Good morning, it's the next day. I have already rinsed out the um, deep conditioner overnight and I'm doing the clay rinse now. So, <clears throat> bentonite clay, um, a teaspoon of honey, teaspoon of olive oil, and two to three cups of warm water. And I have saturated my hair with it. So we're going to see what it do. Okay, I rinsed out the clay wash and this is my hair. I really don't see any difference in the front. This is the area I'm trying to work on. This hair from the root, which all of it would be like this strand. This one strand right here. I wish all of it would be like this. But, well, these more curly are like these, but that's what we're working on. So that's what I'm going to see if I can get this front section right here to be any better. The sides are good. And the back is definitely good. As always, I have no problems with my back. I have applied the leave-in and the gel following the MHM method. And this is my hair. I'm going to let it dry. My long parts in the front, that's just how my hair has grown. Um, I got a cut in February. I got the Diva cut and my hair is wet at this time. And you can see that it is longer on one side already than the other side. So this is my hair. And I'm done. And I will come back to you guys when it's all dry. Hey, curl friends. This is my dry hair following the MHM method. Um, I just want to pop in really quick. My hair is fully 100% dry. And... I washed my hair and did the whole method on Sunday and it is Tuesday um, so it is three days if you count Sunday two days if you don't but either way I'll be doing the method again tomorrow for my third day of the MHM method um, what I have been noticing is that my curls are curls they are more curlier towards the end um, all the way to the end it's less frizz is what I'm really trying to say what I have been noticing in my wash and goes in areas and spots where my curls don't really form as well or as clumped as I would like them I will see spots of frizz and I'm noticing that my hair has less spots of frizz so the MHM method it is working um, it is giving me the less frizz that I was looking for. That's what I'm um, doing the process for to see if I can enhance my curls also in my front patch area um, that I'm always talking about. This front area right here where my curls are the loose, are the loosest in the front. So I'm trying to see if those will get tighter. But all in all, I like the MHM method. I'm used to doing my LCO method, so it's been kind of different um i put some oil on it today the only thing i did last night is i slept on my bonnet and then um this morning i took my bonnet off and i just shook my hair my hair my hair my hair is real movable as you can see and i just fluffed my hair fluffed my hair i spritzed a little bit of water and um, i put a little oil in my hands and just like patted my ends and everything and styled it and that was it so I just want to come in real quick and give you guys an update on my hair and how I'm liking the process. So those are my curls. And that's an area that I used to 
You see, they're all in the root now. They're starting to go in the root. That's in the root. Look at this one. Really nice curls. Forming. So this is my hair on the method and I've done it for two days so far. Be going into day three tomorrow. Start of day three. And then I think on Sunday I'm just gonna go back to my curly girl method and see how that goes. So okay, this is the very finished look of the MHM method day three um I did all of my steps my hair was dry oh, excuse me my hair is a hundred percent dry and this is how I'm wearing it and I am noticing more curls in my front area Let me zoom in. in this area um, but I have it slicked back, but it is improving my overall curls as well. Um, my sister told me that she really sees an improvement in my curls. So I will not be doing the seven day challenge because my scalp is itching something terrible. I don't know if it's the products it's using. I don't know if it's using the products, you know, every three days. I haven't been doing it every day, but I have don't have done the process the MHM process every three days and the back of my hair right here around the nape area has been itching to something terrible so I put some oils on it um, this morning to help relieve some of that itchiness and I said after that I'm going back to my curly girl method so on this coming Sunday I will be going back to my CG method and um, and that's it so this is my hair um, this is sparkle love J naturally Hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button. And I'll make more videos. So talk to you guys soon. Thanks for watching.